Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to North Bay, Ontario. So I'm going for a very specific reason. We're not just going on any other day. Me, my mom, and Addison are all going. So you'll see a lot of them in this vlog. But we're going to see a lot of stuff about the Dion Quintuplets. If you know anything about me, you know I'm obsessed with them. And I am so excited for this vacation. We've literally been through so many things to get to go to this vacation and I'm so excited. So we're not just picking any random weekend like I said before. Uh, we're going for a specific like party thing that's on Saturday. So tomorrow, Saturday, today's Friday. Um, and we're going to this party because it's um, to celebrate 85 years since they were born because on this coming Tuesday they'll turn 85 the two surviving quintuplets and I'm so excited for this party thing because this is like the main reason I guess we're going um there will be like access to the museum their museum currently is in North Bay Ontario and that's where we'll be staying uh because a lot of this stuff is like around there um and yeah actually our hotel is actually on the same road as the museum so that's really cool um I'm trying to think of anything that I'm missing. I'll, we have an 11 hour drive ahead of us today. So today is just basically a travel day. Today's Friday, May 24th, and it is about like maybe 7 a.m. now. I don't really know. I think we're leaving at like 7.30. Um, and I woke up at 5.30 because I couldn't go back to sleep. So I had time to take a shower and do all that stuff. Um, but yeah, we have an 11 hour drive ahead of us. So it's gonna be kind of a while. So if I do forget anything, I'll have lots of time to be able to update you guys. I'll talk to you more when we're in the car. So we're finally in the car. It is 7.57. We are supposed to leave like a half hour ago, but we're leaving now, finally. Addison's saying bye to our neighbor's dog, and then we're gonna go, because she's like obsessed with our neighbor's dog. Say hi to the vlog, Tom. Hi, Blob. <laughs> it's a vlog. No, oh, nine hours and 46 minutes. Okay, not bad. Good. Nine right. hours and 46 minutes. Yeah, oh, because we're not going all the way north past right, you. So if you want to know. We are officially taking off for Canada. Mom, are you excited? Yes, so excited. I'm Ready? so excited. Can't wait. Addison, are you excited? Oh yes. This car is like packed with stuff. There's stuff everywhere because <laughs> we don't pack lightly in this family. No, we don't. So we have about a nine hour and like 45 minutes about yeah. trip. So I thought it was going to be 11 hours, but I'm very glad that it's only less than 10 hours. So we're at a rest stop right now and we're going in to go to the bathroom. So we just stopped at the rest stop and we got a bunch of like, or we didn't really get that many snacks, but we all got uh, drinks and Addison got chips. We're about like an hour from the house, right? Because yeah. we we've yeah. been driving for about an hour now. So eight more to go. So it is almost 10 o'clock. So, so we've been driving for about two. Addison, don't do that. We've been driving for about two hours now. It's 9.59. So it is almost 11 a.m. So we have about seven hours left of our drive, which isn't that bad. I took a nap for like, I was probably sleeping for like a half hour, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm sitting like kind of far down and I don't have my glasses on because I took a nap. Yeah, it's about noon right now. We have stopped at Walmart and we got some Taco Bell. So we're back on the road. We've been back on the road for a little bit now. It's like 12, 15-ish now. Yeah, we're pretty close to Canada. Um, I think we only have like one more big town. We are about an hour away from yeah, from the border, yeah. From the border of Canada. Or Canadian United States border. 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 Um <laughs> I literally can't speak English, that's why I cut so much out of my vlogs. <laughs> no, we have about we have about 25 miles to the Canadian border, eh? <laughs> Us trying to be Canadians for 20 minutes straight. It's about like 1.30 um, now. We're in literally stop traffic right now because we're kind of near the border. We're like a couple miles still from the border. There's the traffic. There's also traffic all the way over there. I don't know if you can really tell because there's like trees and stuff. But 
yeah, we're like slowly, slowly moving. So we finally, finally got out of that traffic. It's 2 p.m. now, so how many Wait, did we say hours until we get there? Did, was that half an hour that we were waiting? Yeah. Wow. At least. It says, it says we only have five hours, four hours and 51, nine minutes now. So. Yeah, so we have about five hours now. So we should get there around like six? Yeah, six, seven, before, sorry, seven. It's five. Welcome to Canada. That's the okay, morning. here we go. Yep, well now we're in Canada. We're officially in Canada. How do you feel, Addison? I'm happy! <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm still eating this burrito. This burrito has been in two, in two different countries. Look at this. Three. Guys, look, Ontario. Lindsay, we're in town here. Oh, I know, I'm filming. Oh, okay. We have about four and a half hours still, um, even though we're in Canada. So, I feel like it looks the same, but the trees are darker. Just in case you're from Canada and want to know what it looks like in the United States, we might the trees be are lighter. Through. I know. But we went to a rest stop, and we tried to exchange our money for Canadian money, but they didn't do that there, so we need to find a place to do that. My phone like isn't working. It said that I have full coverage in Canada, like I got a text that said that. But like nothing is loading, like the Wi-Fi isn't working. So I don't know what's happening with that, but we'll figure it out. But yeah, we still, it's still 2.30ish. So what, how much time left now? Four hours and 34 minutes. Four hours and 34 minutes left. We have about four hours left. It's about 3 p.m. now. Mama, how many more hours? I just said it four hours. So it is 4 p.m. now and we have three hours left. So that's really exciting. I'm so excited to just get there. This is so much faster for you guys. I wish I was you right now because I wish that it would go by faster. We just had the funniest experience. So we've been driving for a while and it has, um, it, how many miles did it say? 178. Yeah, it said 178 miles on my mom's phone but the sign on the side of the road said it was 280. So we were so confused, like which one is right? And we were wondering for the longest time, we were like, are we going the right way? Like what's happening? Cause the right address is plugged in. But then we realized that in Canada, they use kilometers and not feet or miles. 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 Yeah, for a little deary. So it's about like 4.45 now and we still have about two hours left. But we're gonna stop soon for some like food because we're all really hungry and we're getting like hangry. <laughs> so we just finished eating like an early dinner-ish. What time is it? It's like five something. Oh, it's almost six. What time? Whoa. It's almost six. Well, five forty-two. It is five forty-two, and we had dinner at Kelsey's Roadhouse in Petawawa. <laughs> I don't know how to say that. They gave me ice cream, or they gave us ice cream, and it's in this like pouch thing. It's so cute, and it is the best ice cream like I've ever had. I Dang. recommend going to Kelsey's got the same in Petawawa, Petawawa, whatever your town is called. <laughs> we have about two hours left. It is um, about six o'clock now, and I did get my phone fixed just in case you were wondering. So we only have one hour left of our road trip. Why is the sun so obnoxious? Like it's getting it. Okay, well, we're just gonna have to deal with this. I was trying to hold my, wait, um, no, this isn't working. But we're just gonna have to deal with it. <laughs> my mouth is like not even a color at this point. We only have an hour left and we're actually not going to the hotel first. I can't take myself seriously looking like this, but we're actually going to Emily and Yvonne's graves first so because it's actually closer to us right now than the hotel is so we're gonna go there first uh, we are so over this road trip at this point it's been fun but it's very tiring yeah this is the road that the cemetery is on sorry about the windshield so we made it to the cemetery that's it right there and we found emily's grave but what what about what about yvonne it's mom this is their family is that? Oh, I see Dion. Whoa. Whoa. I'm like, why am I uncomfortable? <laughs> Victor and Claude. Mom, their parents. This is their parents. This is Emily's. I don't know where, like, where to step. But 
Victor has the same birthday as my sister Allie, and Claude has the same birthday as my mom. But I don't know where Yvonne is. I kind of want to find Yvonne. Yvonne, where are you? I just looked it up, and it had a picture of her, and it said Yvonne Dion, so I don't know. Oh, this is so cute, though. What? Their parents and Emily both have a sunflower growing out oh, of them. That's nice. So we finished at the cemetery. That was a really cool experience. Sorry for that shaking, but I'm really glad that we got to do that. Like, I'm glad that yeah. we were like, like really we got the opportunity to do that. Me too. And now we're just gonna go back to the hotel. Um, I'm not really that hungry. We are gonna eat when we came here, but we already had like a dinner okay. kind of. Yeah? yeah. We're not just, we're not just coming back because we are. We didn't even go there first. Yeah, we're we're going to the hotel. We're not. Yeah. I don't know if I said. Are we going? Did I yeah, say said we're going? We're going back. To the hotel. Okay. Well, we're not going back to the hotel. We're going to the hotel because we haven't been there yet. But yeah, it's about like a twenty minute drive, right? Actually, seventeen from here. Oh, okay. Oh seventeen from where we are now. So yeah, just saying. Like, if you ever have the opportunity, if you're in like this town, definitely go check that out. We're in North Bay. So this is their house. They're doing like landscaping at the moment. So this one kind of looks like this is the house that they were born in. They have this sign, which is super cool. But I think we're gonna go now. We're actually gonna go to the hotel now. I just really wanted to see this on the way because it's so cool. So we made it into the hotel room. It is so nice in here. We literally got such a big room. I'll give you a little room tour. So this is the door, the evacuation thing. We have some shoes in a bag and then this thing. We have a whole kitchen. Do we mean to take this with us? And a fridge. What is that? One. Oh yeah, Addison likes it. We have a table, a whole living room and a TV and this view. And <laughs> the other side of the hotel, actually you can kind of like see the Dion's house, but this will do. This is just the parking. So, parking lot, that's what it's called. I was gonna say a parking garage, but that's not a garage. And then this is the bed. We're all just gonna share it. I mean, it doesn't really matter. And then there's a TV and then another view, just a different angle. Um, Yeah, this is the bed. And then the bathroom's in here, but there's a big mirror and whoa this is so nice oh my god this sink like can i live here like this is the cutest and there's a closet today was so much fun even though it's mostly spent driving we did have so much fun tonight's gonna be fun we're gonna go swimming i think later because the pool's open until 11 p.m we're gonna go swimming at the pool but i won't vlog anymore tonight because i have so much footage and i really just need to stop vlogging so i'll see you guys tomorrow for day two of canada goodbye and we're back for day two of canada so um after i like stop vlogging last night we literally just went swimming took a bath and then went to bed it was very uneventful so i didn't vlog that so today is a very fun day i think this is mainly the day that we're doing all of the dion related stuff we're only going to be here until sunday and then we're leaving on monday but we still have to drive a little bit on monday because we're gonna um drive a little bit on Sunday night and then drive the rest on Monday morning so we're like splitting up the drive instead of doing that big long drive again um but these like three-ish days are the only days that will be in North Bay so today is like the Dion day <laughs> kind of so today if you didn't know is the party of or the party for their 85th birthday because their 85th birthday is this Tuesday and um, we are going to like a celebration at their museum that we went to yesterday, but we just saw the outside, but we're actually gonna go in it today and we're gonna have birthday cake and have some fun activities there. Um, this is all like thanks to the Dion Quince Heritage Board and the like Multiple Births Associ Association. I can't say that name, like what the actual name is because I just can't say names, but this whole event is organized by them. So thank you so much to them. It's so amazing that they do this every single year. But this year is kind of special because it's 85 and um, 
their museum is opening this year, so they're doing it like inside their museum this time, which is super cool. But first, we're not going to that. We're going to have breakfast in the, like, downstairs of the hotel because uh, this hotel has breakfast. And then after that, we're going to be going to Dr. Defoe's house, which is actually a museum as well now. Um, it's not solely dedicated on the Quince. It's the calendar... Oh my god, why can't I think of it? It's the Calendar Heritage Museum? Is that what it's called? <laughs> wow, I'm horrible. That's what his house is now, so we're going to go visit that too because it's open today. And then after that, we're going to go have lunch at a place that someone recommended me. And then uh, we're going to go to that event that I just talked about before. And then after that, it's just kind of a free, or a free time in Canada. <laughs> I don't really know. We might go like drive by uh the big house which is their mansion um but i don't really know if we're gonna do that today we might do that tomorrow but yeah so today we have like specific events going on that we need to go to before we go to breakfast i want to show you guys my outfit because i'm just in neon stuff this is a sweatshirt that i made and then on the back it says awareness for the neon coins right uh, yeah uh, i don't know Sorry, I have one more thing to say before we go to breakfast. This isn't just to celebrate their birthday. This is also for multiple births, like awareness day, which is also on their birthday. It's only in Canada though, I believe. I don't think it's in any other countries. But yeah, I just wanted to say that this event isn't only for like them, it's for all multiples across Canada, I guess, so. Okay, so it's like pouring rain. I don't know if you can tell, but it's raining. It's not actually pouring. It's like, it's raining now. And I guess we're just gonna try to like look around and see what there is because Dr. Defoe's like museum house doesn't open um, until 10 a.m. and it's about 9 a.m. now. So we have a lot of time to kill. So we went into shoppers. This isn't fully zipped. This looks weird. But um, now we're just gonna go to the Dion's house and just like sit outside of it because we really don't know what to do in this area and we kind of keep getting lost wherever we go we're like something like bad happened so um yeah we're just gonna wait um to go but we still have it's 9 19 now so we still or no it's not 9 19 because that's a couple minutes fast um i don't know it's about 9 19 and we got some kinder bueno bars too uh, because we don't like we have these in America or in the United States, but it's like a lot harder to find in the United States than it is in like other countries. So we definitely need to get these. Addison, we get there's three of them in this pack, and Addison already has one. Do you like them, Addison? Yeah. So that's the update. Um, I'll see you guys when we're actually doing something now. So while we were just like sitting out here, um, waiting just for like 10 o'clock to come uh there was um a woman parked next to us and we were just like sitting here watching videos of their house on youtube and um she came out and said that it's rescheduled for, for tomorrow so the event that's happening uh that will be happening tomorrow but um she doesn't have the keys to the house right now i guess she's like helping with the event tomorrow um but she doesn't have the keys right now but if she did she would give us like a little tour so she said if we come early tomorrow then we can get like our own little tour of the house which will be so cool That's so amazing. like i'm so excited that's so such a cool like opportunity like imagine if we just went back to the hotel like you said we should yeah right Linz. yes we would never yeah know. So that's like really exciting. I'm excited, even though it's rescheduled. Like I'm glad they didn't reschedule it for like next week. That would be horrible. Oh my wouldn't have been God, to go. that horrible. We made it we going to Doctor Defoe's house. Girls, want your coat here? They have their dresses. <gasps> their dresses. Whoa. I've seen Whoa. those. Wait, Lindsay, is this a basket that they that they put them in? Yeah. <gasps> oh my God. Oh look at the babies. Like a little Emily. Wow. Oh my gosh. Wait, let's have this. I have that. Oh my god. And look. These are the coolest. Look at the big painting. Liz. Whoa, look at these. Oh my god, her hair has it. The braid of her hair. Oh, Mom, I've seen those. You have? 
Who, wait, whose is that? Uh, this is, I don't know. This is the coolest thing. Whoa, look at these. Lizzie, look, it's a typewriter. One second. Dr. Defoe and Amelia Earhart. Whoa. She visited them before, she, like, literally weeks before she died. Isn't that, in, or went missing. Whoa. Wait, can you actually, like, look through these? The seal. Um, Emily. Oh, Mom, look at these pictures. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, my God. These are the cutest. Their first birthday. Look, look at, at their the parents. Little... Oh, my God. Look at Whoa, that's so cool. Lens, I want to show you something else. That's cute. Big painting. Yes. That dress. Wow, this is amazing. Lens, look at what else is cute. Oh, that's so cool. They have their little dresses. Yes. I've never. Yeah. Whoa. I didn't see this before. And the Quince the oldest. Minutes up the road, you'll come to the corner store where you turn and go down the road to the grave site. Okay. Yeah. So oh, I, was, yeah. I was curious if you went. Oh. Hi guys, so we have been at the museum. We're actually still like at it, but seriously, this is the best museum like ever. The people that work here are the nicest. Oh, I so recommend, once again, if you're ever in this area, go check this stuff out because it's the coolest. Um, I'm getting money right now because I'm going to pay to get some postcards because I need some pictures of the quince. But it's literally the coolest. They have so many cool artifacts and so many cool like videos and I totally recommend. I'm going to go back in the museum now. Okay, so we just finished up at the Calendar Bay Heritage Museum. And guys, they have the nicest workers ever. Like, and they have the coolest like stuff. I think I, yeah, I vlogged when I was getting my money. But yeah, they were like, that was the funnest experience and I was expecting to go into museum like the museum and like look around a little bit and then like leave after a couple minutes. But how long were we in there? Two hours. We're in there for two hours. Two and a half hours almost. Yeah. Two and a half hours. So we got here at ten. Like exactly at ten. And it's twelve thirty right now, so <laughs> we were in there for a while. But um what was her name? Natasha? Mm -hmm. Uh Natasha, I think. Yeah. yeah. Natasha, like, I recommend going and seeing Natasha because Natasha was so nice. She was with us, like, the whole time. She is doing a presentation, like, this coming Tuesday for the Quint's birthday. But she gave us, like, a, like, a sneak peek at what she's doing. It wasn't finished yet, but it was still so cool. And I learned so much. I've done so much research on them, and I learned so much. Um, we also, she also gave us free postcards of, like, literally everyone that I could find of the Dion's. Um, <laughs> So that's so cool. Like these are the cutest pictures. Um, I'll try to find one like this. Like this is the cutest. Like I don't know, but that was such a fun experience. And we got so lucky. Like imagine if we came in there were so many people. Like oh, we, we would have spent so like lucky. 10 minutes was, in there. We got, but we got so we got, so what, lucky. We got a 45-minute presentation. It was amazing. You have to see yeah. it on Tuesday when she's fully done with it. Yeah. Oh, actually, it's going to be um it won't be um like happening because it already happens when I'm posting this vlog. We're gonna go to a place called the Oak East Eatery. Um, Sarah Miller, uh, who I met through Instagram, um, recommended it, but it's closed on the weekend, so we can't go to it. So that's sad. We're gonna go there, but um, we're gonna go to another restaurant because we're really hungry. We spent a long time there. We did have breakfast at the hotel, but. I didn't have very much food, so. There wasn't just like Quint stuff in there. There was a lot of like other stuff from like around the area. I so recommend going there. Like even if you're far away, just go. It's fun. So we just finished up at lunch. We had lunch at the White Owl Bistro, or is it Bistro? Bistro. Bistro. I don't know how to pronounce words. This whole vlog, I've probably been butchering every single word. So it was good food, like it was good food. But like, it was just a really weird, I don't really like uh, those kind of atmospheres. <laughs> so I haven't updated in a very long time. Um, so after lunch, I think is the last time I updated. I don't really remember. But um, we really just did nothing. We went back to the hotel room and then we relaxed for a while and it is now three, like 30-ish. So yeah. Um, we're going to go to 
the why can't I think of what it is? They're like old road, basically. So there's a couple things that are still on this road, but it mainly is like most of it is gone. Um so their mansion is still there. It's basically Quinland. Yeah, it it was where Quintland was and like where the Dion's lived and everybody went. So um their mansion is still there. Um what of Quintland is still there? Like the um little entry the, like what is that? The entry to Quintland is still yeah. like the little building. But um, the like the whole building isn't it, there anymore. Or is it? No, but the No, no, the, no. I'm like so confused with what's the there house, and like, isn't one of the schoolhouses. Yeah, like the schoolhouse apparently is still there. Um, but it's basically like if you just pass by it and like you didn't know who the Dion's were, like it would just be an average road to you. Like it doesn't like stand out or anything now. But back in the day, it was flooded with people tr- are going to see them. Oh my god, there's a wedding! Oh my god, there's a bride. <gasps> but people are getting married. You, I hope they have a good just look your marriage. Room? I mean, I. Okay, so we still have a little bit of a drive until we get to um, the Dion's, like, road, I guess. I guess it's their road. Yeah, kind of. Quintland, I think. Quintland, yeah. So, um, like, the old area of Quintland. So we made it to our destination after getting lost, like, a million times because the GPS wasn't working. But... Like, a lot of this, like, I don't know if you can see that. That's actually what they added on, like, behind my mom's head. There. Um, that's, like, what they added on. So, that wasn't there when they actually lived in the house. But I'll show you, like, a little bit of it. Because I can kind of show you, um, like, what was here when they were here. This is, like, their school, right? Yeah, this is where their schoolhouse was. So, this is, like, where they did school. And this used to be, like, a big building. This was just, like, the entryway. But they just had this, like, little shed. It's kind of hard to see from this angle. But if you go, like, over here, you can see it from, like, the it's front. It's red cool. instead of pink. But, yeah, they, like, it just, like, has, like, a pinkish tint to it, I guess. You know. But, um, yeah, that was a lot bigger when Quintland was here. And then, but I guess this was a different color because this, this is definitely not the color that it was. And then back there where Addison is, can we, like... Um, show, like, when we go oh, back to that park. Yeah. Okay. Make sure that you're... Wait, can you zoom out? Mm-hmm. I wanted to see what it was like when we first built it. So, like... And also, this fence, it used to be barbed wire, um, so people couldn't get in. Mm-hmm. But they took it down because they don't need it anymore. But it's actually open. Like, the gate's open. But this is private property, so we can't, like, go to it. And this is all just, like, run down when there's nobody it. living in it. Whoa. That's what it looked like originally. Whoa, wait, wait, that's wait. so cool. Wait, wait, Mom, look. These roads have seen a lot. <laughs> the roads are, like, too bad. Um, up here is their mansion. Like, you where know like, the sign was, guys? That somebody took one of Oh, them? yeah. Like so they used to have a sign here. No, on the other side. Um, yeah, on the other side, too. And it said, like, Dr. Defoe's Hospital or something like that. And they had one... Over here too. Apparently, someone bought it. Like it came up on eBay, but it was like really, really expensive. And someone bought it, I guess. Here, do you want to take this home? This is this is this is Quinlan. Yeah, this is part of Quintland. Quintland, um, Pine Cone. Do you want- I can't yeah. believe this is where they live. I know. Okay. Like in the picture, we didn't see the mansion, like on the side. Yeah, but that, but that was because it wasn't built until like uh-huh. later. That wasn't built until they left. They didn't live there anymore. This is the mansion. I feel like people are gonna look at me. But yeah, that kind of is our last like big thing that we haven't been to yet. Um, so we wanted to go to Emily's grave. That was done. Wish we could have seen Marie and Yvonne, but we couldn't find Yvonne and Marie is buried like hours away. So, yeah, I wonder where Yvonne's buried because I literally have no idea. Maybe she's buried with Marie and, like, that thing just has it wrong and they just confused Emily with Marie. Like, I I don't know. And then we went to their house. We haven't been inside their house, but that is tomorrow, so just stay tuned. Um, and then um, Dr. Defoe's house, we hit that. And then their mansion is last. But this is, like where everything was, like Quintland, 
and the mansion and where their house used to be but obviously they have moved it since they've moved it twice now so yeah i have already like a dion collection but i'm definitely going to be adding a lot since we came here I mean, there's not really much we can do. It's not like we can go inside or anything. So, that's all. Next up is to just go inside of the Dion's house. And then we're kind of done with all of the stuff that we haven't done yet. So, mm -hmm. I think we're going to go back to the hotel and swim. So, we made it back to the mm -hmm. hotel room. And I think we're going to go swimming. It's about 5.30 at the moment. So I don't have my glasses on for this clip because we just got back from the pool and my hair looks crazy. It's still up, but um, it's not like up. Like there's still ponytail in it, but like, okay. Anyways, um, but we had a fun time at the pool. We we're there for kind of a while, um, but now we're back. It's 7 p.m. now. And we're just gonna. Relax. It's really fun. I think we might have a barbecue because they have like places to have a barbecue outside. Wait, but so I think we if might it's wet, out. it's wet though. I know, but we can still have a barbecue when it's wet. I can't believe it's 7 p.m. already. Like it's so bright outside. Like we're using natural light for this, so it's really nice. I'll show you the view. It's not really any different from yesterday, but it's like really foggy. So it's like 8.30 now. We watched um, a part of Million Dollar Babies, which is, which is the Dion Quince movie. It's on YouTube. Um, and that was really fun. I took like, yeah. not really a nap, but like I was closing my eyes because I'm really tired. My mom went to the store and got some stuff to grill because there's actually like grills outside. So like you can like cook your food. So we're gonna do that. Um, and she got a lot of food. Um, I also put my hair in a bun because my hair got all, got all messed up, as you probably saw in the pool, so I don't feel like redoing it, so it's just okay, in a so bun. But we got lots of food, all right, um, and I'm so excited. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, I'm so I think I already talked about this, so I gotta read that. We got some, like, salad and stuff like that, so yay, we're gonna have a fun dinner. But also this kitchen, I know I already showed it, but it's so nice. So, my mom is going to tell you guys what the grocery store was like and how different mom, it is. You these. So, they have things that look like things that we have, except for they have gum, and it's called Excel. And that's, I was like, oh, it's mom, Excel. You these. But is that gum? It's gum. Mom, you want these. And I also saw the nugget. Mom, the North Bay nugget. The, the North Bay nugget. Me. That's the newspaper that broke the story of the girl's birth wife. And that's right down the street from here. The that's nugget. Right. I'm eating a chicken nugget. Okay. Look how foggy it Mom, is. Mom, I see so many bats. You do? Yeah, come here, come here. See? It's literally the foggiest. Those are all bats. But we're right, grilling at the moment. They sound so cute. It's the hotel. You can't see the Dion's house bed. from here. But we're pretty close. Like behind this building, I believe like back there Wait, is their look. house, I think. It's Mom, how's grilling going? Excellent. Taking a while for it to heat up, but... Yeah, this is the meat. Vegans beware, but we like meat, so whatever. So it's like about 10 o'clock now, and we're going to go to bed. Um, we are beat. Today was the longest day, and we did so many fun things, and we, it was just a great day, but I have food on me. It's not fun to realize after you've been filming for 30 seconds. Yeah, so we're going to go to bed, um, so I'll see you tomorrow for day three of Canada.